Today I'm having a typical Japanese breakfast, which is very healthy. This is rice with the rotten beans with natto and raw egg. My name is Kruti. I'm a PhD student at Brickin and I start my day with jogging with friends. We're off to work. Good morning. We are in one of the rooms in the Nano Science Building and this is where I do most of my Raman experiments. Welcome to the underground facility. I think this phenotype is really strong. I think we can publish it. <laughs> really? So we are in Tokyo Dome and taking so much food from all over Japan. I study two different systems where the general focus is on how cells change from one type to another with cellular reprogramming. I'm doing research in Riken on epigenetics. Uh, and I have been here for the last eight years. Our group is working on breast cancer metastasis signaling pathway. Right now I'm doing more Western blotting and it is one of the most important steps which I'm doing right now. Marco, I'm presently postdoc at Riken and I would like to study the physics of exotic nuclei which are produced here by the worldwide largest superconducting cyclotron that stands just right here. I'm Keiko Sugimoto from Wiccan. I study regeneration plants, so that is how plants repair themselves after injury and make up new shoots and roots, and I want to understand more like a mechanism behind the plant regeneration. Welcome to my apartment. Welcome to my tiny garden. Beautiful night in winter in Kobe, Japan. It's a beautiful Sunday morning. We're just going out for ski. So, so far I've completed uh, two years in Japan and uh, it's been a wonderful experience. This is my Kendo Dojo. For me this is a very exciting place here because uh, um, I can have the honor to work at the Nishina Center for Accelerator Based Science. This is a production facility for exotic nuclei, which means atomic nuclei that are not found in nature. I like uh, quite a lot of things about Regan and number one is Regan is very international. So you have people from many countries here. So I like this environment and uh, being in Riken also exposes me to other scientists in the world because they know about Riken. Come to Riken!